your plants and heating your home safely, but only the dark blue counties have to worry about those pipes tonight. And so we're seeing those wind chill temperatures down in the teens to 20s with actual temperatures in the upper 20s and low 30s. I'll walk you through your pinpoint forecast for your neighborhood coming right up. President Obama makes his exit after attending a local wedding this evening. This is video of Air Force One taking off. The wedding was held for White House Travel Director Marvin Nicholson and his now wife, Helen Padgett. She also has worked at the White House and is the daughter of prominent local attorney Steve Padgett. And of course, it was a very loud night in Avondale where the wedding took place. Hundreds of people lined the streets to see the commander in chief. Tonight, Channel 4's Destiny McKeever joins us live from Avondale. And Destiny, you're outside the home where the wedding was held. And it turns out the president was there as more than just a spectator. Yeah, Ethan, we're told that he was the best man in this wedding. And as you can see behind me, still a lot going on here. We're thinking that this is the reception. There's music, and you can see back there some dancing taking place. And a lot of people, when they found out that the president was going to be here in Avondale, they said they wanted to be here to welcome him. Sold out. Get a good video, girl. And cameras rolling as many cheer in excitement for the president's arrival in Avondale. Families wait even with their small babies for a moment they once only dreamed of. I was very surprised and excited at the same time. I felt like, well, maybe this is the chance that we, we will meet him. As President Obama left a wedding where he was said to be best man for White House travel director Marvin Nicholson, we got a closer look at the home where the wedding was held. Nicholson's bride, Helen Padgett, the daughter of prominent Jacksonville attorney Steve Padgett. And we're, you know, friends with some of the Padgett family, and, and so we're excited for him. It's a, it's a big day. It's a, a wedding. It's a special day. It's a special event. Although the president was only in town for a little over an hour, people who packed St. John's Avenue say this night is one they'll always remember. You never get an opportunity to do something like this once in a lifetime, and I'm glad we had the opportunity to be a part of it. Now, you may have seen this photo circulating the internet. That's the groom there on the scale, Marvin Nicholson. He's President Obama's travel director. In this photo of the president creeping up behind Nicholson and placing his foot on the scale, presumably pressing downward in order to add a few pounds to Nicholson's weight there. And that's during a visit to University of Texas. Very funny. So uh, as you can see, just still a lot going on here, and we'll continue to bring you the latest on newsforjax.com. Reporting live tonight, I'm Destiny McKeever, Channel 4, the local station.